Hello and welcome to the All Hockey Hair Team. People were wondering if I'd divide up into private and public school for the Hockey Hair Team, but instead we're just going to keep it at one tier, the way it should be, pure. At number 10, coming in from Marshall, we have Alex. And I know a lot of people don't like the word moist, but that's the only way to describe that look. I think he used a spray bottle. Nothing wrong with that. At number nine, this is an underrated clip here. Let's take a look at Dan. He's got a sneaky little mustache there, a little caterpillar on there, and he's pretty happy about it. If you look at the smirk here, kind of a Dennis the Menace mustache going on there. Like it, like the fun. At number eight, we got our friend Wyatt from Duluth East. Just the little underestimated thing here on top, the wave, the tsunami. That's called Hurricane Wyatt right there. At number seven, we went with just a grinder here. Just hard work, old school mullet for Dallas. I mean, that's just tough is what that is. Now we get into just purity. Not a lot of gimmicks here, just great, great hair. Starting with Eastview's Brett. Fantastic, really fantastic. Number five, this actually might be the actor that played OC in Miracle in which case he's probably too old for the tournament, so we should look into a birth certificate if possible. And at number four, we have Nathan from up uh, east in Grand Forks. Kind of Tarzan here, real nice. Love that, a little bit longer, darker than we're used to. At number three, you've heard of the Harlem Shake. This is the Hermantown Holy Trinity. We start with Joe. Just old school mullet. Again, a little bit of spray bottle, which we like. Followed by Christian, who's doing the cotton candy. I mean, that is just absolutely awesome right there. And finishing up with, uh, with Jake here, who shows us that Hermantown is indeed nearby Bethlehem. At number two, uh, this kid wanted the slow motion so bad. Watch him hop from foot to foot here. Oh, he wants me to do slow motion. Nope, not going to get it. He wanted it too much. You got you to gotta read it, not write it, buddy. And your friend here, Kyle from YZ, understands that sometimes the game comes to you. Let's take another look here as we see, yeah, the wind tunnel for YZ. That's why you're number one, bud. You earned it. You deserved it. In honorable mention, we got a lot of good stuff here. Uh... Flaherty from Marshall's a, a standby here, and for good reason. He's the Irish Pat Riley. He's really got great game, inspiring for his players. Breck, you know, that B on their jersey, a lot of people think it's for Breck. It's actually for blow dry. As you can see, a lot of their players do that on a regular basis. They build it right into the team fees. Look at that side part. Nice side part there. like that a lot. And in the world of the mushroom, that is a portabella, my friends. That's as good as it gets. Nice, another goaltender here. Not a big fan of neck guards, but I like the old school mullet. Very, very nice. A little bit of uh, just classic, classic flow here. Feathered from Duluth East, as well as a little Duck Dynasty. That's a serious man beard for a high school. Very, very impressive. Hill Murray, we got a nice message uh, and a nice mane. Very nice, very nice, like that. Don't usually get off the board here and look at post-game interviews, but as you can see, this looked familiar to me. I don't know where I'd seen that. You know, a lot of people ask me if I'm going to keep doing this, and I think I will because it's information you can't get anywhere else. Would you like me to search the web for who had the best salad in the state tournament? Searching the web for who had the best salad in the state tournament. Tournament nutrition guide. Terrible. Yeah, Steve isn't the guy to make the eye flow, that's for sure. But like my friend Whitney said, the children are our future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. It starts with Rocco, who put the Oh My God into Osseo Maple Grove. Check it out.
As always, if you were featured in the All Hockey Hair team, call Megan at 651-765-9611 for a free cut. Because when it comes to hockey, your hair does matter.